So now that we know these two topics, with these two topics, what was it? It's a pretty broad question. What do you guys think? You know the payload is. Like how do you win a payload now? So what payload is? Is a time. It's a battle with time. 우리가 A 포인트 공격 때한 칸을 먹었든 두 칸을 먹었든 우리가 B 포인트에서 중간에 막혔든 C 포인트까지 밀었든 중요하지 않아. 한 칸을 먹었다는 게 중요한 거지. Yeah, it doesn't matter whether whether there's one or two points on A or if we got up to the middle of B or to whether there's C. It's the fact that we got a point. 왜냐면 우리가 A A에서 완벽하게 먹으면 되잖아. Because that means all we have to do is block them completely on that first point. 그리고 여기 중간에 페이로드가 있는 거고. And in the middle of that distance is the payload. Payload is a buffering unit. Buffering unit. So a payload technically is just an additional factor. It's an extra factor. So 우리가 기본적으로 payload에서 제일 중요한 게 뭐가 있을까? So what's the most important thing? 우리가 어떻게 해야 시간을 많이 부족할 수 있을까? How are we able to gain as much time as possible? So closing season one, we were very unhappy with our performance. We wanted to take a big leap in uh, investing into our academy team and making sure that they're the most competitive they could possibly be. Uh, in that sense, we were very deliberate about who we chose and why we chose them. So during my break in Sweden, I started ramping up my work a little bit and I started working remotely and including in that, I obviously was part of the building process of the contenders team. I trialed Together with our academy staff, I trialed a lot of the players. We scavenged every region for, for you know the best players around, and uh, you know the qualities that we were looking for were mostly players who were either Overwatch League ready already or guys who we thought that within a short amount of time we would be able to get to that point. So we ended up keeping three of our players from last year, uh, and those three players being Paintbrush, who we felt uh, really impressed us uh, with his. You know, he is an extremely coachable player, uh, very vocal, a, a good leader. He uh, still has some room to grow in, in that department, but very mechanically skilled in, as a main support and is just so hungry to learn. And it's th that, that hunger and, you know, his, paired with his mechanical skill, uh, we felt like he was the right fit uh, to, to lead this team and be one, one of the leaders and one of the vocal leaders of this team. Boom. There we go. My name is Nolan Edwards. I'm actually from Salamanca, New York. It's a lot easier to say I'm from Buffalo. People don't usually know where Salamanca is. Usually have a good idea of Buffalo though. Uh, I do play main support for Mayhem Academy. So I do IGL in game. I'm kind of the team role model or team leader in game and outside of the game. We're gonna take a dive for Buffalo, okay? Die, no more, I'm not dying, but I'm so being on site in LA uh, playing Overwatch, it's an amazing opportunity. It gives you a lot of room to kind of focus on just the game and everything that goes into being a high level player. And being here, it's, it's really cool to be a part of Mayhem Academy, like building up from the ground up and becoming what they want us and we know what we can be. But the big thing here is making sure that we're developing as players and becoming the professionals that we are meant to be. Um, as far as my mindset, I like to take a really positive, clear-minded route. Uh, it's really important for me to always look to improve and maintain that positivity. So going forward, I think that will really come in handy. Obviously the most experienced player out of our entire roster is Hagapun, uh, coming out of most recently, London Spitfire and also GC Busan. Um, again, everyone knows how, how good the guy is. He's an Apex champion. He's uh, a stage champion in Overwatch League. Uh, and for us, when we found out that we have an opportunity to get him, he was one of the primary guys that we uh, aimed for because you know, from a mechanic standpoint, he's extremely skilled. He's uh, experienced, he's experienced on stage.
안녕하세요 저는 한국에서 왔고요 어, 이름은 조현우라고 하고 하고픈 이라는 닉네임을 쓰고 있습니다 그리고 AM 아카데미에서는 서빌러 맡고 있습니다 팀을 이전에 있던 팀에서 나오게 되면서 팀을 새롭게 구했어야 됐는데 이제 이 메이엠 아카데미 팀에서 이제 저를 좋게 봐주셔가지고 이제 기분이 좋았습니다 일단은 팀에 들어왔을 때 목표는 무조건 난 우승 무조건 우승이고 그다음에 더 거대한 목표는 이제 오버워치 리그에 다시 들어가는 거죠 그러기 위해선 많은 노력이 필요하고 많은 성장이 필요하다고 생각합니다 결국 걔네가 이미 입구까지 딱 사먹기 다 먹어가지고 윈드로 들어간다고 하는데 메르시가 메르시랑 디바가 필만 해도 윈드 터지게 일단 글래디에이터 아카데미 팀 같은 경우에는 좀 그러니까 선수들을 잘 알지는 못하지만 한 명의 선수는 아주 뛰어나다고 알고 있거든요 코리라는 선수 아주 잘한다고 알, 알고 있기 때문에 쉽지 않은 경기가 될것 같습니다. 그 오늘의 경기 때, 우리 플레이 글래디에이터 리전. 우리 어, 이 워밍업 블록 라이프 비포 어 스크림. 우리 하고 올드 코치즈 인 히어. 우리 하고 플레이어 즈 컴인 앤 스펙테이트 시 하우 더 가이즈 웨어 디잉. 우리 우리 루킹 포워드 투더 매치. 렛츠 렛츠 고 인사이드. Oh, Zilberg gate on the other end. We can go full dive. It says, oh, well, don't dive into the mouth of the dragon. You might get eaten. It has shacks. A sad, sad dragon blade where, oh, it's not even that. You're just done. You're done. With that Mayhem Academy, we're going to flip the point. 99, 100%. They <laughs> walk away. <laughs> 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 When it comes to oh, us, no. he gets one. I don't know if this, this is enough, but no one's looking at Blase. They still might get it after all. It was looking like a cabinet spray. Like a pick up here. Anti air from the back. Why is he even there? How did that even work? But they don't get back on the point. Okay. Focus is work, but he gets it. Comes up into the corner. Dashes back in. And this is good high level disruption from the tank line of the Legion. And with no one on the point. Milky Man uses the primal rage. Actually, jump. First and foremost, you guys worked really hard. You guys worked really hard, and you did well. 그래서 너네가 알아야 되는 게 우승하는 팀 대부분 대부분의 팀들이 처음에 막 많이 이기고 막 올라가진 않아. 원래 16강이나 밑에서 한두 번 치고 올라가는 거라서 그냥 진 것도 좋은 경험이라 생각하고 좀 우리가 진 거에 대해서 많이 생각해야 되고 고쳐야 되고 피드백 많이 해야 되고. So uh, I do want to let you guys know that all the good teams, good teams that you see, um, they don't start from the beginning by winning and they keep winning and get to the top. Uh, they all have experiences of losses, especially in you know round of 16 or what have you in a tournament. And the most important thing is to learn from that experience and uh, you know, study that loss. Um, so all things considered, you guys did, did play well. We were surprised by all the compositions, and we're gonna, you know, prepare a lot harder. Uh, and like Ryder said, you know, this is a league, and ultimately, uh, where we are right now won't reflect where we will be at the end of the season. You know, uh, we it, it is a league, and if we just get in the playoffs and we make sure that we peak by the time of the playoffs, then we have an equal amount of chance to win, just like any other team, right? Okay. Alright, no. Good. GG. Thank you. 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 Thank you.